The money was supposed to go to state programs and agencies like Medicaid and parents as teachers. Instead, the governor is spending the money to clean up Joplin. Tom Schweik says the governor's office can't even prove how much money they'll need for the cleanup. Uh, the first thing that they learned was that there was no data supporting the $172 million. They could not produce a single spreadsheet, projection, actual revenue, data, uh, estimated cost of Joplin. They asked, can you give us some support for the, how did you get to $172 million? A governor typically withholds money from state agencies when revenues fall short. The auditor says simply moving money from one purpose to another is improper reallocation. But the real reason for today's news conference was the media coverage Schweik's lawsuit has received. A St. Louis Post-Dispatch editorial titled Schweik's Folly claims the auditor is out to get Nixon because his own budget was among those cut. That is blatant dishonesty. It is corrupt, it is dishonest, it is libelous, it is false, and is a tremendous disservice to the people of Missouri who have to read junk like that. When the Post-Dispatch knows darn well just reading the lawsuit, that is not what this lawsuit's about. Schweik also defended his values. I care about Joplin. I've got extended family down there. I've been down there. I've donated. I've given them accounting advice. I've met with the people. I've expressed my empathy and sympathy for them. And for them to write an article saying I don't care about them is corrupt, dishonest, and a total disservice to the people of Missouri. Schweik demanded the Post retract the editorial and apologize. Daniel Wynn, KRCG News.